a very beautiful evening to you and happy new week you're welcome back you're welcome to the show Unka, which when translated to english means art in case you're just joining us for the first time Unka is a show where we express various forms of art where we have great conversations about diverse artistic expressions and where we bring to your screens your favorite faces here on afia tv broadcasting live from the cold city of enugu state of odifen on dstv 254 and go tv 17 my name is divine on Ohio, your queen of great conversations. I'm your host for today. Don't go anywhere. You're welcome back to the show. Like I said earlier, Nka is all about art. So rest assured that every face you're going to be seeing on this set is an embodiment of amazing creative ability. And today is not going to be any different because we have just been joined by a super talented artist who goes by the name Mega B. Good evening. Yeah. <laughs> Good evening. Uh -uh. <laughs> you see, your dressing is not aligning with the way you are speaking. What's happening? <laughs> You're being gentle this evening. Hey. What's happening? Yeah, I'm good. How are you doing? I'm fine. How do you feel about being on set with me? Okay, I feel good. You feel, feel good? Nice. Yeah. Okay, so let's get on to it. Now, I've been hearing your story. Yeah. I've been hearing your exploits. I've been yeah. hearing all the... All the things you've been doing, even though you've been doing as if you're looking, but you're not looking anything. So tell me a little bit about your experience as an artist in Enugu State. Okay. Um, my name is Kuo Megabi. Yeah. Um, based on music experience, I, you know, we are youth and a lot of things is happening you know so we don't just do music like we 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 preach gospel in music you know like do your thing do your stuff believe in god you know you're gonna make it in life okay yeah so that's it so with what you've said clearly you're a gospel artist yeah yeah pure gospel only gospel or you do other things i too? do other things too like what okay what genre precisely like i do i do rap i do love songs you know yeah but based on what is happening right now in the country i have to focus on gospel <laughs> yeah yeah so. okay now that is funny <laughs> so you're trying to say you didn't start off as a gospel artist yeah yeah so you were doing normal you know vibing yeah, vibing yeah, vibing songs yeah, yeah. and then the country was getting yeah, worse yeah, and yeah, worse yeah, yeah. and then you thought no 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 we need to pray for this country yeah, we, we need, need to really to, we bring need god to, into it yeah we need to pray you know nothing like you it's now you know things are very hard mm. you know like me, I love to, you know, I believe that I can, you know, convince people through music. Okay. You know, yeah, so that's it. So what exactly are you convincing people to do? Apart from, of course, your gospel side where you preach the gospel, you tell people to follow yeah. God, repent yeah. and all yeah. of that. Yeah. You also said you do other things. You talk about love. So yeah. what other things do you like? What's the content of your music? What else yeah. do you preach in your music? Yeah, I preach about, you know, believe, you know, whatsoever that you're doing in life, just focus on that thing that you're doing. Believe on that thing, you're going to make it. Mm. Yeah. Believing, self-confidence, yeah. and all yeah. of that. Yeah. But that's very, very beautiful. Yeah. That's beautiful. But I still want to ask you, how did your journey begin? Because we all didn't just wake up one morning yeah, and say, what yeah, to start singing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So how was it like from childhood to the point where you decided, I want to do this professionally? Yeah. How did it start for you? Okay. Um, it started uh, when I was a kid. You know, my elder bro, you know, he used to do all this music stuff, rap. You know, we were like, I was like, let me just join him and we started doing it together 
Yeah, right now he's in UK and mm. I'm the only person now that's, you know, doing it alone. And I believe that I'm gonna, you know, I'm to gonna make yeah, it. Yeah. How old were you when you started? Um let me see, I'm fifteen. You were fifteen when you yeah, started? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So what was your parents' reaction to it? Because I know that in this part of our world, yeah. <laughs> our parents want us to study medicine, yeah. law, yeah. and all of those professional courses. So you walking up to your parents one morning, okay, I think I want to do music. What was their response like? Yeah. Um, you know, um, when my brother, my, my parents is, you know, they are late. You know, and... Oh, wow, so yeah, sorry. Yeah. So my auntie that we are with... You know, when my brother told her that he wanted to do music, and my aunt was like, um, okay, since you're going to make money from it, do it. Mm. Yeah. So, that's, that's it. <laughs> yeah. So, she just agreed. Yeah. There was no difficulty yeah. and yeah. all of that. Yeah. But how were you able to combine it with your studying at the time? Because if you were 15, I'm assuming you were still in secondary school at the yeah. time. Yeah. So, how did you combine it with school and, you know, how, how did anyway, you do it? Anyway, then I, was, I wasn't that too serious. With the music? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So, now that I have graduated, I have to do, now do it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. from secondary, you moved to tertiary institution. Yeah. Was that when you got serious or you waited until you graduated? Yeah, I waited till I graduated. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's quite an inspiring story. <laughs> <laughs> an inspiring story. But of course, I'm always curious about how these things work for you guys who have decided to, you know, go into music full time. Yeah. What has been your major challenges so far? You know, um, when you don't have uh, money to go to the studio and, you know, other stuff, like, you know, so I just feel like, you know, let me just do it on my own. I believe in myself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I, I do my thing, you know. So that's, that's, that's how I am doing it. So number one, finance. Yeah. Money uh, to go to studio. Yeah. And I'm sure after going to studio, you will still have to push your song out there. Yeah. You need to promote yeah. it. Yeah. You need to do a whole lot of things. So yes, money is one. What other challenges? You know, um, when you're trying to meet other artists, like, you know, um, like when I meet Aguero Banks. Okay. Yeah, I I met him when I we went to eat. You know, I was you know, but before then I told my guy that I would love to feature Aguero Banks. Hmm. So uh, luckily for us, we went then and we met him. You know, so my guy, you know, met him. You know, they discussed. I played my song for for him. Okay. God is never late. Hmm. You know, and he was so impressed, you know, and I have song with, uh, I have song with him and I still have song with other artists, 6KG. Yeah. So that's it. So I, I think I missed the part where you mentioned the challenge because <laughs> you just told me you met yeah. Aguero Banks yeah, okay, and okay. he was so impressed and yeah, so happy. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah, what's yeah. the challenge? You know, um, for for us to do music, you have to you know like give him something and it's still money. Okay, for features, yeah, 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 mm. yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. So, so um, you know, to 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 make money, you know, it's not it's not easy, you know. So, but we 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 try our best you know, to do it. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, so now, are we uh, establishing that? Because I've had this conversation with several artists, and yeah. one of their major problems is, aside money that you will yeah. even give yeah. for, yeah. you know, features. Feature, yeah. One of the major challenges they always mention is the fact that gaining as access to yeah. these bigger artists yeah. is a problem. Like, yeah. they don't even get the chance to meet yeah. with them. Yeah. When they do, 
they either get some kind of behavior, maybe some unfriendly behavior yeah. or unfriendly yeah. vibe or yeah. something like that. Yeah. So that's what I mostly hear. Yeah, yeah, aside the yeah. money aspect yeah. but how has your experience with that been will you say you you find it easy approaching the bigger guys will you say they always you know they're open hearted yeah, towards yeah, you yeah. you know it depends on who you met you okay know? yeah it depends. not all of them are yeah, like not that all of them so there's like whiskey now nah, um, and whiskey before whiskey before you can put your whiskey like, at least you guys who you know vibes to vibes together mm. you know get to know each other each before other. yeah so that's how he does his thing you know and it depends on who you met like i said before mm. yeah so but in the southeast let's narrow it down to the southeast now yeah. Yeah. Will you say that artists in the Southeast are, let me just use this word, let me just use it plain this way. Okay. Would you say they are proud? They are unreachable? Or are they friendly? Are they open-hearted? Yeah. Are they, you know, which of them? Yeah. Um, some, are, some are proud, you know, and some are, some are, you know, when you met them, you know, talk with them, they will rapport with you. Then. Well, yeah. So, what percentage? Because you are being very, very, <laughs> you are giving me some kind answers. Yeah. So, uh, let's let's do it by percentage. Now, what's the percentage of the ones that are proud, based on your yeah. own, you know, yeah. your own opinion? Yeah. I would say. Um, let me say. Let me give them like nine percent. Nine percent. Yeah. Yeah. So the remaining ninety-one percent yeah. are very humble yeah. and yeah. very cool yeah. and very chill. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So that now makes me wonder why am I not seeing a lot of well? Let me not say me. Yeah. I'm saying based on conversations I've had with other yeah. artists. Yeah. Why are we not having a lot of collaborations? If everybody is friendly, yeah. everybody is welcoming. Yeah. Why am I not? Uh, wh why is this conversation still on yeah. about an artist meeting an artist and they are just unwilling to uh, be featured? They just want to do their uh, thing solo. Why do we have cases like that? Since everybody is, you uh, know, humble yeah, and yeah. accommodating. Let me just say, some people are, some people are proud. You know, if you don't, if you don't give them something, they can't feature you. You know. That's my own experience. Okay. I don't know for other people. Okay. Yeah. So that's it. Some people, some guys are cool. When you meet them, like when I met CKG, we just, you know, but, have a little mm. conversation. We do our music, you know. So that's it. it depends on who you met. Mm. Yeah. But the ones that are cool, the ones that are very accommodating, yeah. at the end of the day, do they really demand for huge sums of money in order to get featured? Or they just no, go ahead no, and no, vibe no, with you? No. They just go ahead and vibe with you. You know, you give them whatsoever you want to give them. Mm. You know? Yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to ask you, because, of course, you are the one wearing the shoe. <laughs> you are the one on the table. Yeah. You and several other artists yeah. out there. What do you think that the southeast music industry can do differently yeah. just so that these problems are solved because i believe that if i'm an upcoming artist yeah. you are an upcoming artist yeah. we should be able to come to a compromise you know and i believe in synergy yeah. there's a way you come together yeah. do a mad hit song like this yes, yeah. there's no way there's no way that the whole of Enugu yeah. and the whole of the South is will not hear it and even beyond. Yes. There's a way collaborative efforts can be put together yeah. and you people will just shine forth yes. beyond yes. the shores yes. of the Southeast yes. even. Yes. So I want to ask, what things do you think, what do yeah. you think Ndi Enugu yeah. on the Southeast can do yeah. to ensure that these challenges yeah. Are you know reduced or brought to the barest minimum? Yeah. What do you think that we need in this house is especially for the music industry? Yeah, open if, if they can, you know, have something like um, organization. Okay, an organization. Yeah. There isn't any right now. Yeah, I don't. I didn't know. Okay, I didn't know that you know we you know organize the stuff like maybe let's uh, group or let's just do this thing 
you know, or people that will tell that will tell people to, you know, the artist to do it. Do, do you understand me now? I'm trying to. You were saying people how, that will tell how, the artist. Yeah, how am I going to put it now? Don't worry, put it anyhow. So I am able yeah, if yeah. you want. <laughs> okay. Like, it, you know, we have big artists. Okay. You know, if that we can work together, you know, if they can organize it for the upcoming artists. Okay. Like, okay. Or, we upcom or we upcoming artists can say, okay, since this guy can do this thing mm. and I can do this thing, the other person can, can do, do this the, thing. Mm -hmm. Let's team come together, together and, you know, make a hit song. Mm -hmm. do, you, do you get But for me, I haven't, you know, I haven't seen it. So I don't know if it depends if we can organize it. I believe that you know we will make a hit song. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that's an amazing idea yeah. actually. Yeah. Collaboration, yeah. coming together, synergy, very very amazing idea. Yeah. But and then I think you should also consider: is there something like an annual concert for everybody in the south? Is for everybody in Enugu so far? Yeah. Yeah. Has there been anything like that? Because I know of concerts, but you just yeah. have a few artists. Yeah. It could be a particular one that a particular artist is hosting, yeah. like the Jeric yeah, live yeah. concert. Yeah. Yeah. Is yeah. there any one that you could do as Ndienugu on the Southeast? Yeah. No, I don't think so. Mm. I don't think so. So uh, that's it. Um, Jeric is, is the only person that used to like uh, organize the kind of mm. uh, this concept. Okay. You know, so um, there was a time when Pino is doing it, but now Pino is not doing it anymore. It's now <laughs> Jerry's turn. Yeah. So that's that's how it goes now. But eh, let me still ask, mm -hmm. and I like the way this conversation is going because we are brainstorming. You know? Yeah. <laughs> we are really brainstorming. Yeah. Ideas are coming, you know, coming to light. And yeah. I think that at the end of the show, you could even come up with something. Yeah, I'm sure you have friends in the industry that yeah. you can just meet. Okay, let's just do this, no matter how small. Yeah. What is very important, I believe, is consistency. There is a way you do something so consistently. You don't know the people it is reaching you. Yeah, Before you yeah. know it, you just get a big gig yeah. from somewhere, you know? So, but back to what I'm saying, mm -hmm. I've had, like I said, I've had conversations with various artists. Yeah. And one of the things that we've continued to hammer on is the need for those bigger artists, yeah. the likes of Flavor, the likes of Fino, yeah. and, you know, all those legends in the yeah, industry yeah. to look at the southeast a little yeah. to look towards the southeast not just signing people in lagos yeah, yeah, all the time yeah, yeah. they should come down here but you guys the artists has there been any effort made to reach out to these people because they uh, i don't think they will know so much especially because they are not here in yeah. the southeast most of them yeah. are in lagos yeah. but have people made any effort to reach out and you know strike a deal make a proposal to them yeah. has yeah. there been any effort of such you know, you know nature some some are doing it you know but for me i like i try to uh, write some of the big artists you know somebody like um um okay let me not mention names okay no yeah, it's fine yeah yeah but um you know none of them have replied me have answered yeah but what am i gonna do i'm still gonna do my thing of course yeah of course yeah so that's life <laughs> you know you have to believe in yourself, in yourself. do your thing mm -hmm. you know and god's time is the best yeah, you cannot, you will not just say, let me do it now. If once, once God said that, it's time. It's time. Yeah, you're mm -hmm. going to do. So, that's it. You don't, for me, I don't rush life. I do my thing. You know, God's time is the best. So, that's it. I believe that one day, people like, if you know, we hear my song, he, mm -hmm. he will call me. And future me, so that's an uh, other big artist, yeah. So that's it, okay. I agree with you too. God's time yeah. is the best, God's yeah. time is the absolute best, okay. So now I'm going to ask, how many, how many songs do you have so far? Okay, I have like, I have um, like 
six songs, you know, and I have other freestyles. Okay. Yeah. So, but I have put one online. God is never late. Mm. Yeah, that's the one that I put online, and I'm still working on my EP. Yeah, but before that, I'm gonna drop one more one single. One more single. Okay. Yeah. So I'm working on that. Okay. Any yeah. albums yet? Uh, no, no, not yet. Okay. Yeah. That's that's. I mean, that's a good start for anybody. <laughs> that's a good start. Yeah. But let me now ask you: Do you ever feel the need to leave the southeast? Do you ever feel the need to? go to Lagos or any of those other places? Yeah, of course. Once I, I, you know, I make my hit song and I uh -uh. blow, uh -uh. I, will, I will move to Lagos. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> you don't even know that I just set trap for you now. You don't even know. I always ask that question because I also hear what you people say. Mm. Which one is that once you, you do your hit song, you just... You just uh, jump on no, and you must get. Money is everything now. Once you get the money. So there's now. no money here in any <laughs> There's no money in the southeast. Is that no, what you're trying to say? No, there is money here. But <laughs> you can anyway. If one of you go to Lagos, who will be here? <laughs> Eh? Okay. Lagos, Seth, let me yeah, tell you, Lagos yeah. is Lagos is saturated. Yeah. <laughs> Lagos has too many people. <laughs> okay, in, in your mind, come take a new nature. She does what you have in your mind. Out of my own ways, you open now. <laughs> so so is it that you're not seeing any hope? Is this not a fertile ground? Is this not no, a green? I'm seeing, I'm you know? seeing hope, you know. I'm seeing hope. So I believe the soon. I'm gonna blow. Okay. Yeah. yeah. We don't just like I said before. We don't just do music. We give hope to the world. Mm. Yeah. So that's it. That is very inspiring. I must say, <laughs> we've got a whole lot for you guys on this show. A whole lot. There's still yeah. more to ask you. Yeah. There's still, there's still so much more to discuss. So mm. don't go anywhere. In car, we'll be right back. Okay. And my name is Divine Onoha, your queen of great conversations. Of course, I've been having very amazing conversation with the super talented Mega B, who has been right here with me telling me about his journey in the musical, in the music industry. Welcome back to the show. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> it's uh, always your <laughs> opening speech for me. You just go, thanks. Uh, <laughs> like you're oh, pushing oh. yourself. <laughs> All right, so let's go back to what we're talking about. Of course, we've said a lot about your journey yeah, so far, yeah, and I yeah. must say, you're really inspiring. Yeah. I like how tenacious you are. I like yeah. the fact that despite all the challenges, we're still pushing, and nobody yeah. is going to, you know, bring yeah. us or hold us back. Yeah. Now, I'm going to ask you a rather unusual question. Okay. Now, I want to know, what would you say your most horrible experience has been in mm. this industry? Mm. So far, all your, you know, all your life as a musician, as, a, as yeah, an artist, yeah. what would you say your most horrible experience was? No, for me, I don't think I have had, um, you know, any horrible experience. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. None at all? Yeah. yeah. Wow, that is, yeah. you know. Okay, but of course you've had your best, your, your yeah. best experience, your yeah. best moment. What yeah. would that be? You know, I would love to be with, um, you know, Obio, you know, I would love to chill with him. Wait, you've been with him already? No, no. Okay, I'm saying something that's happened to you already. before that you really, really love, that you consider your best moment okay, as an artist. Okay, 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 okay. Um, I, I remembered when we are in, when I was in school, you know, I always... Then I was I was I was I was a dancer, mm, you know. Okay. Yeah, I used to dance before, and I met this guy. You know, I didn't know that uh, the guy is uh, the guy related to P Square. Okay. Yeah. So uh, one day uh, P Square, they when they were together then back then, mm. you know, they came to to the east. They have show, and the guy asked me to come around, you know, and chill with them. Okay. Yeah, so when we were, you know, entering the stage, 
with biscuit, you know, we are at the back, you know, the vibes, like the swag, I was like, wow, wow. Zimi, you know, <laughs> yeah, so, so that's, you know, that's, that's the, for you, the yeah, best yeah, experience yeah, so far, yeah. okay, I'm, I'm quite glad that you've had something that's, you know, life changing yeah, for you, yeah. and that's why we're going to be doing this very, very brief Okay. exercise <laughs> okay. so we always want to remind our guests our artists yeah. how far they've come yeah. because no matter how how much you think you're not yet there because yeah. of course we're not yet there yeah. all of us even yeah. me <laughs> no matter how much you think you're yeah. not yet there the truth yeah. is that you're not where you started yeah. You know where you started. Yeah. There has been some level of progress. Yeah. There's been some little, little steps yes. of greatness yes. so far. Yes. So we're yes. going to be looking at Mega B's throwback pictures. <laughs> and of course, he's going to tell us things about these pictures, where he was at the time and what those pictures are about. So let's mm. have it. Uh. Wow, this okay. doesn't look like a throwback. <laughs> Where was yeah, this? Okay, this was when um, then I was with Aguero Banks. Okay, when you were with Aguero Banks. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We are, that's, you know, that's the day that we did our recording. Okay. Yeah. How many years yeah. ago? In the, like few, about six months ago. Oh, not yeah. been long. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right, let's have yeah. <laughs> what were you doing in the bush? <laughs> okay, uh, this uh, those twenties uh, now where we used to go, where mm. we started. Okay, you know, yeah, like sometimes we used to go there, go there and have and vibes, you know. Yeah, this is and um, when we are doing. Um, Music, vi uh, music video. video. Yeah, okay. God is never late. Oh, wow. No, yeah. And this is, okay. Yeah, that's the same day. Okay. Yeah, yeah. How many years ago was this? This is about, let me say, five months ago. Five months ago. Yeah, okay, yeah. where was this? Okay, this is where we went to shoot video on God is never late. The 20s. Um, oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Hmm, that's amazing. You don't even have throwback. You see, your life has been very beautiful. <laughs> no, I have. Don't worry now. I will still, you know, show those pictures now. Okay. Let me just, you know. Next time, we're going to dig deep. Okay. <laughs> dig to the deepest parts of your social media uh, account so that we okay. can get all those throwbacks that you're hiding. Because I went, I saw your Instagram page. Uh, you're just shining all through. <laughs> no, 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 no. There was a beginning. <laughs> Yeah, we'll yeah, go back yeah, to that beginning, yeah, but yeah. of course, this has been a very, very huge yeah. um, milestones that you've managed to, you know, accomplish. Yeah, yeah. And of course, I'm so happy for you, and I'm rooting for you. I'm rooting for you. Yeah. All right, we're yeah. going to be getting to our game segment. This is where it gets really, really interesting. Yeah, okay. So, you know what the games are like? Have you played? No, have you watched no. the games before? No. Right, you're going to be rating the artists that we have in the southeast. Okay. You rate from best to worst. Okay. Yes, from best to worst. Okay. And you must rate it. You must rate all of them. If you don't rate, you are going to drink <laughs> this very beautiful, sweet drink that we've dropped before you. Yeah. So, shall we? Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. Great. So, rate from best to worst, these artists. Number one, who go pee. Let's have their pictures. Mm. Okay. Cola Boy. Mm, okay. Number three, Aguero Banks. Number four, Jerick. <laughs> and number five, Quincy. Rate from best to worst. Your time starts now. Okay. Who is your best? Should I call the I'll names again? I will say um, all of them are doing good. It's a lie. 
no, 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 they no. are all doing good, yeah, yeah. but you're meant to based on your own rating. You cannot okay. like everybody equally now. Yeah. There must yeah. be one that you like better than you know. Anyway, so anyway, let's for me, for me, I have not, you know, been able to chill with Jerick. Anyway, okay. Yeah. And but based on their music now. Okay, based mm -hmm. on their music, I would say um Okay, let me go for Agoro Banks. As your number one. Yeah. Okay, yeah. now you have it. Agoro yeah. Banks, shout out. <laughs> you are Mega Beast number so, one artist. So who will be your next? Okay, let me. Okay, Jerry. Jerry. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And who will be your third? Uh, Ugo P. Ugo P. Yeah. Okay. And who else next? Who's your fourth? Mm. Yeah. You still have Quincy, you still have Cola Boy. Okay, then um, Quincy, then Cola Boy. Chinekina. Cola Boy is your fifth. You know, the guy is doing okay. Okay. You know, he's doing, I love the, I love the guy, I love the music, you know. Okay. Yeah. But you just like yeah. Aguero Banks yeah. better. Yeah. And all the other. But I would I would love to work with him. With okay. who? With, um... With uh, Cola Boy. Cola Boy. Yeah, love to work with him. But you just mentioned that he's your fifth. Yeah, you know. Based on your rating. <laughs> no, it doesn't matter. It doesn't, it doesn't, for me, it doesn't matter. You okay. Know, yeah. Once you, everybody know the kind of vibes they, the they do in their music. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. So, for me, everybody is doing well. Okay. Yeah. All right, we're still going to be rating more artists. So you're going to rate from best to worst again, okay. this artist. The first I have here is Zorro. Let's have the picture. The second I have here is Slow Dog. The third I have here is Eel Bleez. The fourth I have here is Fino. Uh, <laughs> and finally, Odumo du Black. Yeah, so you're I going to rate know. from best to worst. I, I'll call them again Zoro, Slow Dog, Eel Bliz, yeah. Fino, and Odumo du Black. Who will be your first? Fino. Fino! Yeah, <laughs> okay, I saw the way you smiled when I mentioned Fino. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so who will be your next? Uh, um, um, Odumod Black. Odumod Black, second. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Who's the third? Um, let, show me. Let me. Okay, so yeah. we still have um, Eel Bliz, Slow Dog, Zoro. Okay, Zoro. Um, Zoro is your number three. Yeah. Then Eel Bliz. <coughs> Eel Bliz. Slow Dog. Then Slow Dog. Yeah. Okay, so you have it. On this second batch, his favorite is Fino, and the fifth is Slow Dog. Yeah. All right, we're still going to do something else. We're still going to do something else, but right after this short break, don't go anywhere. You see, I refuse <laughs> to spill the beans because it's going to... I mean, we're almost coming to the end of the show, so we yeah. have a lot more in store for you. And Kabu will be right back. Stay tuned. Welcome back to the show. My name is Divine Onoha, and I've been your host on today's show. I've also yeah. been seated here with the super talented Mega B. Hi, Mega B. Uh, <laughs> I like the fist sign. <laughs> You're welcome okay. back to the show. Yeah. So, yes, we just played a game and he rated some, you know, Enugu, some Southeastern artists. And just so we're clear, it's a game. Okay? It's a game. Don't okay. take it personal. All okay. right. We're still going to play one more game. And I'd just like to know you better. Are you in? Yeah, okay. Now let's do this. Best places to live in the Southeast. Enugu or Oweri? For me, I would say Enugu. Enugu. Yeah. Okay. Egusi or Onubu? Onubu. Onubu. Yeah. Abacha or Pizza? Abacha. <laughs> <laughs> so why 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 are you doing this to pizza? 
No, I love local food. Okay. Yeah. Suit or traditional? Suit okay. or traditional wear? Let's say suit or senator. 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 Yeah. Uh -uh. Okay. All right. Clubbing or sleeping? Um, two of them. <laughs> I club. Choose one. And, okay. <laughs> will you rather go to the club in the night or would you rather just sleep? I would house? rather to. Eh? I would rather to work on my music. Okay. Yeah. So going to club will help yeah. you do that. Yeah. All right. So that's clubbing. Call or text. Call. Okay. Yeah. Uh, meet thirty women or meet forty women. None. Ah. Uh, so so, what's your spec? <laughs> okay. Confession time, Ungwa. What's your spec? Um. Okay. Let me see. 23. Yeah. <laughs> 23. Yeah. You got far. Okay. So you don't do elderly, young, no. fresh blood. No. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, light skin women or dark skin women? Light skin. Light skin. Yeah. Okay. Loyalty or respect? Loyalty. Loyalty. Yeah. Chicken or goat meat? Chicken. Chicken. Yeah. Uh, fufu or amala? Fufu. Fufu. Yeah. Moi moi or akara? Akara. Akara. Yeah. And puff puff or buns? Buns. Buns. Yeah. Fried rice or jollof rice? Jollof rice. Asun <coughs> or unkobi? Unkobi. Okay. Yeah. So. In case you are wondering what um, Mega B likes and what he doesn't like, you want to know, you have to get to know him more. Dude, I hope this game has helped you. If you still need to know him more, you have to follow him on his social media platform. Yeah. And of course, on Instagram, he's Mega, official Mega B. So yeah. you can follow him there in case you want to tell him one or two things. If you want to okay. toast him, you're also free to. <laughs> All you need to do is just slide into his DM. Yeah. Now we're going to do our final game before we call it a wrap. Okay. Mega B. Yeah. Earlier on, I was going to ask who you'd want to feature. Yeah. If you were given a chance to just pick anybody, who would you pick? Okay. I would love to, I would like to feature Odumo Du Black. Odumo Du Black. Yeah. Okay. I thought you said Obio at first. No, I, I, I would love to feature Odumo Du Black because I think that. You know, he can give me what I need now. Okay. Yeah, the kind of music, of music that I you want do. now. Yeah. Okay. Odumo the Black. Yeah. Who else? Then David O. David O. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Any other? Uh, Burner Boy. Burner Boy. Yeah. Okay. Now, I did that to give us soft landing. Okay. Who is your all-time favorite artist? all-time favorite like he beats every other person for you okay i will say In peter Nigeria. p square p square yeah, peter p square you know. okay so yeah. there too when they were together right yeah okay peter yeah peter, peter specifically. Yeah, not rude boy peter okay. yeah mimic peter behave like peter in 10 seconds okay let me just <laughs> The kind of break dance you used to do, you know. Okay, <laughs> do it now, do it. Just stay. Don't, don't go too fast so that uh, the camera will capture you. Okay. You want to go. Okay. Fitness, the kind of moves that I used to do. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. Sing one of his songs. Um, uh, sure I'm, I'm anyone, just sure. anyone. Mm. Okay, let me see. Um, Your time is going. <laughs> the one they, they did it together. Yeah. Go on, just sing yeah. it. Let's it, go. One, okay. two, go. It, if you nanya, if you nanya, you maka, you maka, if you nanya, oh, you know, be 
I can't wait to hear your songs. I can't wait to, okay. you know, uh, of course, you have something cooking this year, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. What should we expect this year? Okay. Um, you expect um, more like, you know, gospel, you know, more preaching. Gospel? Yeah, preaching. Preach. Uh, yeah. Okay, that's where the Lord is leading you this yeah. year. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, more gospel um, singles. Yeah. Your EP. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's beautiful. Yeah. Thank you so much for joining us thanks, on the show. Thanks. All right, guys. That was Mega B. And of course, telling us everything that we need to know about him. Like I said, like I said, Nka yeah. is all about art and all about exploring various artistic expressions yeah. and various having conversations with your favorite faces, with people you'd want to meet, people you want to know, and people you want to see on yeah. your screens every day and every time. Join us tomorrow. Join us next tomorrow, every other weekday, because we're going to be here, same station, same time, giving you all the things that you need to know about your favorite artist, about arts, about creativity within the Southeast. Of course, that's what we're here for. Make sure that you follow us on all our social media platforms. Mm. And big news, big news for you guys. Afia TV is giving out free advert promos to every vendor, to any vendor who is interested, courtesy of the trade fair going on. So you can reach out to us, reach out to Afia TV, reach out to us on our social media platforms and our emails. And of course, if you're interested, you stand a chance to get free promo for your business. So if I were you, I'll jump into that opportunity and I will let it waste. My name is Divine Onoha. It was nice having this very amazing moment with you. Yeah. See you soon. Have a lovely, lovely day.